Thank you for calling Home Depot Urbandale Services. How may I assist you? Ah, uh, hello, darling. Can you hear? Hello. Me? How can I help you today? Yeah. Um, I, this is a tricky situation that's happened. Uh, I need to talk to somebody, I guess, in wood. In lumber? Okay, sure. One moment, ma'am. Oh, hey, excuse me. Yes, ma'am. Um, do they do they assist people here in, in building certain items that they need? Um, they can. I think at the contractor's desk, they can kind of help you come up with a plan. Yes, ma'am. I believe so. A plan? Would they help me also bury a body? Oh, you know what? Let me just transfer me to wood. Okay, sure. One moment. Mm-hmm. Urban Dell Home Depot. This is Brad. May I help you? Oh, my God. Somebody answered. Uh, who is this, darling? My name's Brad. Brad, I need some uh, help. Uh, um, I don't know how to put this lightly, but I need to make a coffin. And, okay. And, and I needed somebody to assist me because my husband's dying and I need to prepare for his death and I need somebody to also help me dig his grave in my backyard if that's possible. No, I'm sure it's not. Where do you live? Urbandale. Well, you would have to talk to the city in regards to something like that. Why well, would I have to talk to anybody? If I'm going to put my dead body in the backyard, why, what would that matter? It's in a coffin. And he's over there dying. Right. He's dying. He has some kind of colon cancer. And I'm getting tired of it, darling. He's pooping all over my floor. I put the pens on him, and it just goes everywhere. It, it's, it's a mess, okay? I'd rather have him a mess in the coffin in the back. I, it might sound heartless, but I'm tired of cleaning up his shit. Okay. And and he, you know, poor thing. He he's his name's Rusty. He's seventy-five years old, and poor guy. You could probably even hear him yelling, "Shut up, Rusty! I'm on the phone." Sorry, darling. Okay, so how do we how do we go about building the coffin, darling? What do I need to buy? I have no idea. You're in the... uh, we don't do anything in regards to that. Well, you have wood, don't you? Yes, we do. I like oak. Uh, do you have oak? I guess yeah, he needs some we oak. oak. He would prefer oak. I don't know why. I guess it reminds him of the retirement center he used to go with Shady Oaks. But I guess he wants oak. Oh. Um, how much is it per square... <laughs> what did you say? Get the pine, it's gonna stink. I, I, I don't know what he's saying. He wants something so it doesn't stink. Okay. Okay, I guess he wants some pine uh, wood. Pine, the pine wood. All right, I don't know how you're gonna go about building it. Six foot plank. And I. He needs something in six foot um, and six feet of plank wood of, of the of the pine wood. You wanna, can I get some rope and hang him and get it over with now? Because he won't shut the hell up. Are you still there? I am still here. Okay, so how are we gonna do this? Can you help me if I come down there? Hello? Yeah, well, I'm a little confused by this conversation, ma'am. I, I, I don't know how to put this. It's just he needs to go. And he hasn't paid any rent with me for years now. He's a leech. And I, I figured leeches go to the bottom of the surface. And I need to... I need, shut up, Rusty! He doesn't, he, see, he doesn't stop. I'm so sorry about this. I didn't have intentions mm -hmm. of calling and, and giving you a headache, darling, but uh, I need wood. And I need it now. She'll suck your dick. I, I'm not sure exactly how we go about this. I mean, I don't know how you're going to box it up. Can't you can't... Uh, 
this the city's not going to allow something like that. Already banged up permit. What was that? I don't know. He's over there. He won't stop. I'm yelling at him. I try to cover the phone. I don't get my phone job before I go. I'm sorry. Okay, so the city, who do I have to call about this? Who do you have to call? Do I have to call somebody to to put him in the ground properly? I don't know. Because I don't know what the, the dimensions are to put him in a box. Put his ass in the ground, collect my money, and move. I don't like Iowa anymore. I want to move. I'm sorry I'm putting all this on you. He keeps yelling at me. He hit me last night. And I have a bruise on my cheek. I'm tired of this son of a bitch. <laughs> and he and he laughs at me like it's funny. Hmm. I don't know what to do, darling, and I'm sorry. I, I don't mean to have all my personal problems at Home Depot, but... And I'll call that with Prince Valium. What am I supposed to do? I do not know, ma'am. You won't help me build a I damn simple box? Box, you asshole. Nope, box? we don't do that. Do you have, I, I don't know, I, what what dimensions do you have a box that we could build? Because you could saw it in half and you could, you could uh, hammer it together, can't you? No. What do you sell that's in we a don't. box size? I need a box. And you're not helping me, darling. I, you're not, you're just telling me no. I need to talk to a manager. All Somebody. Right, I'll send you to him just a second. You are you're very unhelpful, darling. I just I don't know what to do.